once you've adjusted the total alkalinity in the hot tub water, it's now time to adjust the pH in the water. Simply put, the pH is a scale ranging from 1 to 14, with 7 right in the middle being neutral. Anything above 7 being basic, anything below 7 being acidic. The ideal range for the hot tub water for the pH is between 7.2 and 7.6. There's a few reasons why we want to keep it in that range. The number one reason is for bather comfort. That 7.4 is the pH of our bodies and the pH of our eye. So that's the number one reason why we want to keep it in that range. So a low pH can present its problems. A pH out, out of range and below 7.2 can lead to corrosive water. So the water is acidic. The corrosive water will attack any metal fittings in your hot tub, so it will start stripping away the heater and stripping away the metals in any jets that you have. So it, it, keeping your pH in line is very essential to protecting your investment. A low pH will also lead to bather irritation, as we talked about before. So it, you, you want to keep that in line to enhance the soaking experience. And the third thing for a low pH is that the sanitizer, whether it's chlorine or bromine or salt, whatever sanitizer you're using, it'll become unstable and will dissipate rapidly. So in a low pH situation, you'll find that you'll have to continually add sanitizer to keep your sanitizer levels up. So if your pH is low, you want to add a just up. After you test your water, after you've got your alkalinity in line, you test your water, look at what your pH is. If it's low, add a just up. There's a dosage chart on the back of the label, easy to follow. Not a lot is needed to be added to adjust it. Um, you add it with the jets on, let it circulate for about half an hour to an hour, and then retest. Now a high pH presents its own problems. A high pH can lead to scaling, um, and scaling of metal parts, most notably the heater, and if you have an on-zen tub, you can scale up your, scale up your electrode. And in a saltwater tub, the pH tends to creep up. So you have to really watch that pH so that the electrode does not get scaled up. It can also lead to metals being precipitated out of the water. Just like calcium precipitates out of the water and becomes scale. The metals can come out and that can cause metal staining, like a rust stain, and water discoloration. As well, a high pH leads to bather, bather discomfort as well, and it affects the sanitizer. It makes the sanitizer slow reacting, so it doesn't do its job as well. It doesn't keep the water clean as effectively. So the pH is very essential into the overall water maintenance of your hot tub and the overall maintenance of your hot tub. You keep it in line and it protects the investment. It it ensures the bather comfort and it's essential to the effectiveness of the sanitizer. So pH is very important.